Good morning. Today we're here at Meyer. We're going to go and check out some of the sales prices for the week, some of the things you guys have asked about, and check the shelves. Let's get to it. This is we come into Meyer here. Notice they have their bell peppers on sale, three for three dollars. It's a pretty good deal. Get them for a dollar a piece. You do have to buy multiples of three. Do like I do, chop them up and freeze them. Looks like the only apple sale we have at Meyer this week are Honeycrisp apples. However, they are 99 cents a pound. That is a great deal. Regular price, $3.19 a pound. Meyer does still have their strawberries on sale, $2.99 a pound. That is down from $3.49, but the big deal of the week here next to those Honeycrisp apples are the raspberries still on sale. Six ounce packages, 99 cents. That is down from $2.99. Well, I was wondering when this was going to happen. We've see, seen fewer and fewer bananas here at Meyer lately. They always have them, though. Every time I come in here, whether it's a little or more than a little, they always have some. Uh, they did go up in price, though. 55 cents a pound. That is up from 49 cents a pound. Someone on the channel here was asking about red radishes. Uh, ironically, they just put these here in, in here at Meyer. These are 79 cents a pack. These are 8 ounce packages, 79 cents. Seems like a pretty good deal. They do have a lot more cauliflower back in here. It is $3.29. $3.29 for a head of cauliflower. They do have the broccoli crowns on sale down to $1.29. So pretty good price on those. I did want to mention too, regular price on these now is $1.49. So that's actually came come down from $1.69. However, these sweet little petite carrots here went up. Regular price on these now, $1.99. That is up from $1.69. $1.79 on sale though this week. So, I don't know. I mean, they're pretty good carrots, but keep going up in price. Probably the best looking lettuce I've seen at Meyer in a while. They are $1.79 now too. That's come down from $1.99. It's been $1.79 for a couple weeks, but the lettuce has just looked terrible to be fair. It's kind of looked bad everywhere. Looked pretty good this week. $1.79. This is the biggest grapefruit I've ever seen in my life. These things are huge. They are three for $3. $1.29 uh, regular price a piece. But if you get three of them, get them for a dollar a piece. Got these giant, large Caracara Naval oranges here. These are 99 cents each. We had a long time viewer asking if I could check out the prices of limes, if I could find any good deals. I really haven't. Meyer really isn't the place to get them either. Two pounds for $4.99. $4.99. They do have the wonderful seedless lemons here. Two pounds for $5.49. Still terrible price. Five pound bag of mandarins here. I gotta say, some people were saying that they really haven't looked that good. I'll tell you, they really don't. Um, the best ones I've seen of mandarins lately have been Aldi. Those are the ones that have looked the best. This is five pounds for $7.99 also. This was $6.99. It's gone up a dollar. I, you know, I don't know. The fact that they don't look good, I, I wouldn't buy them. I, I would just wait, uh, maybe check somewhere else. I don't know. It's the second week in a row where mandarins just have not looked that great here at Meyer. They don't look good at Kroger either. We had another viewer asking about garlic. They do sell the single... Uh, cloves here of garlic they are 69 cents a piece you can get the one pound package it says 2.99 there but it says 3.29 here i know they were uh 2.99 so they may have gone up and just not have changed that sticker yet we do see where the regular price of these tomatoes on the vine have come down to 2.19 a pound that was the sale price uh, and they were $2.49 a pound, but I will say, like, the sunset ones look good here, but whatever this top line tomatoes are, they do not look as great. One of our longtime viewers who shops at Meyer all the time swears by these Frederick's Campari tomatoes. They're good. They're good. I, I usually wait till they're on sale, though. $3.99 for these is a little high, but everything's going up these days. Spaghetti squash, butternut squash, and acorn squash are on sale for $1.19 a pound this week. Not as good of a sale as we saw a couple weeks ago. They were $0.99 cents a pound. Uh, regular price, $1.29 a pound, so only $0.10 cents off a pound. With all the comments on over-the-counter medicines kind of disappearing off the shelves and prices going up and just all kinds of craziness, 
Wanted to come over here and check Myers stock here on medicines i mean they are out of some but it does look like they have a good amount and they've got some different deals going on here with this buy one get one of equal or lesser value 30 percent off not too bad what is this deal on motrin buy one motrin tylenol dual action 18 caplet liquid gel migraine and pm select varieties get one 25 percent off of equal or lesser value so that's something that you may be able to add on to this extra deal. But yeah, they do got a good amount of over-the-counter medicines here at Meyer. I did find this other sale over here. Buy two, get $5 off instantly. Mucinex, Delsum, or Airborne excludes the PSE of that, but buy two, get $5 off. Does look like this buy one, get one of equal lesser value, 30% off does include some of the different cold medicines as well it's good to see and they have this i don't know if this would be like this at your Meyer, but they have this specific stand here for all these products that are buy two get five dollars off all right moving on to some of the steaks here they have the eye of round angus beef uh, uh steak here boneless 4.99 a pound um they got the t-bones here look at this 9.99 a pound 13.99 a pound regular price Time to stock up on these. If you got some extra freezer space, might be the best sale we see. Uh, about a month or two ago, they had these for $7.99 a pound on sale, but the regular price was a little lower. $13.99 now, regular price, $9.99 a pound on sale. Well, here we go. Here's a little bit of a better deal than we've seen lately. 80% lean at the Meyer hamburger. Good quality hamburger right here. Regular price on this is now $5.69 a pound. $3.99 a pound on sale. If you're getting ready to smoke a pork butt or something, they got these still on sale here at Meyer, $1.99 a pound. That is down from $2.99 a pound. Good quality right here. They have their whole boneless pork tenderloins or center cut boneless half pork loins. Buy one, get one of equal or lesser value for a dollar. Wow, that's a good deal. If you're looking for a ham here, $2.49 a pound for the Myrel, the Myrel, Meyer Spiral Ham here, $2.49 a pound, regular price $3.49 a pound. Don't know if these will get cheaper toward Thanksgiving or not. This may be the cheapest we find here at Meyer. A little bit of a sale on the Meyer Drum Legs. Sale price is higher than we've paid though on sale price. Usually it's about $0.99 cents a pound when it goes on sale, but the regular price is now $1.69. A pound regular price, $1.29 on sale though, still pretty okay. The only other sale that they have at Meyer, which I don't see any on chicken, is the Meyer whole chicken, uh, all natural, $1.29 a pound for that as well. So just the, the whole chicken and the legs on sale this week, $1.29 a pound. And I got the black label by Hormel Bacon back on sale here at Meyer, $5.99. That's down from $7.49. Price has really gone up on that. That was $6.99 less than a month ago, regular price. I hope you were able to pick up some of the deals on Oscar Meyer they had last week. Because uh, they are back up to $8.49 for the 16-ounce package. And then the 22-ounce package is up to $10.99 now. Now we got some turkeys here at Meyer, Although I don't believe they're on much of a sale, though. They do have the Meyer Young Turkeys on sale. $1.99 a pound. And they have the Plainville Farms turkeys here on sale. I don't see, oh, here we go. Uh, wow, $4.99 a pound. Ooh, that's crazy. Got honeysuckle here. This is $2.29 a pound. Yeah, so these haven't come down yet. They should come down a little bit lower as we get closer to Thanksgiving, I hope. Uh, let's see, Butterball, I believe, is $2.99 a pound. Yep, $2.99 a pound. Wow, $75.41 for this turkey. Yep, that's a little expensive for me. They do have just the chicken breast here of Honeysuckle. This is $2.49 a pound. That one is $8.06 for that one. They do have the Butterball just chicken breast here. These are all 48 ounces, 3 pounds, and they are $15.29. Someone was having trouble finding distilled water here. They do sell it at Meyer. Not sure if you have a Meyer. Do notice the price went up though. Uh, they were a dollar twenty-five, now up to a dollar thirty-five. So, I'll uh, continue. You know, it's been an issue for the last few years. 
I'll continue to keep an eye on it as we go along. Okay, so I was just curious what the prices were on these cashews. We saw these for $10.99 at Big Lot yesterday. I thought that was a little high. $6.59 here at Meyer. And this was this was the size, guys. That was it. I don't know if they had it in the wrong spot. Might have been this one. I don't know. This one's a little bigger here. It's 14 ounces for $9.59, but it definitely was not that size. Meyer cheese is on sale this week. Sliced cheese. Different varieties. Three for six. You do have to buy three packs. But you get them for two dollars. Meyer cheese is really good. They do have different varieties of the Meyer shredded cheese on sale as well. Three for six. You can mix and match between the sliced and the shredded, but you do have to buy multiples of three. They do still have the Sargento shredded cheese on sale. Buy two, get one free. I know a couple of you that bought these up last week. It's a pretty good deal. It goes on until October 28, 2023, and then they have Tillamook on sale. Two for $8. Uh, that's down from $4.29 a pack, so you save about $0.60 cents buying two of them. You do have to buy two. All kinds of cheese on sale this week. Now, I don't think this is that great of a deal. Actually, not a good deal at all, really. This is that sliced up cheese of Cracker Barrel. I mean, it is really good. $5.59 is ridiculous. It used to be $4.99. I thought that was ridiculous. On sale for $3.69. Good time if you want to try it, I guess. I think the last time I bought this uh, here on sale was $2.99. And I got the sharp white cheddar. It is really good. I will say that. They also have the Meyer uh, little cheese sticks here. These are two for six. Well, I see Pillsbury biscuits finally went up here at Meyer, pulling that Kroger thing where they raise the price and then throw a sale on it. So, shop at Meyer. It's a good time to buy up a couple of these because these were three dollars and fifteen cents. Now three thirty nine, two for six though. So I'm gonna buy up a couple of them, store them away. Okay, so if you're looking for Puffs Lotion tissues, you may want to go to Meyer. We saw these regular price at Kroger for $9.99 the other day, which <laughs> that is just absolutely crazy. But $7.19 still here regular price, which is surprising. Kind of makes me think that this sticker may be wrong. Though. But they slapped a sale on here, two for $13.50. Regular price $7.19, so maybe it is still this price here, but we've been seeing these go up everywhere, so I don't know. Meyer might be the place to get these. I know we get a lot of comments on them. No sales this week at Meyer on any Folgers or Maxwell House. That is so weird. Usually we see one of them on sale. No sales on the Javelia either. $17.99 now for that. Look, Duncan dropped though. This was $18.99 on sale, and for whatever reason it dropped another dollar. I don't know. Maybe people aren't buying it. $20.99 is now the regular price. Uh, $17.99 on sale. 30 ounces. Meyer brand coffee is on sale. The Keurig pods here. $3.99 down from a overinflated $5.19. These went up. Uh, they, boy, you know, these have gone up a lot in the last year. They went up from $4.19 to $4.29. $4.49. Then finally $4.79. And then $4.99. And now $5.19. I mean, that's like five or six different price increases within the last year. $3.99 on sale, though. Definitely, um, let's see, my favorite's probably the donut shop. Uh, the house blend's okay. Uh, they don't have any sales on the bigger ones that skyrocketed in price here. These are $30.99 now. I noticed they got Tim Hortons coffee on sale here. Uh, regular price did go up on this. Somebody was saying that it was $7.49, now $7.99. $6.99 on sale this week, though, for the 12 Keurig pods. Mick Cafe is part of this uh, Imparks deal where if you use the $2 off Imparks, they become two for 10, so you can get $5 each. If you don't use the Imparks, though, they're $6 each, so still on sale. Um, it'd be two for 12. That sale does include the Green Mountain Coffees and Original Donut Shop. So you can mix and match between the ones on sale here. Uh, I do believe you can only use the Imparks deal once, but they are two for 12 after that. So get them for six bucks a box and Duncan is on sale. Keurig pods here, still $8.59 regular price. We're expecting that's gonna go up. $6.99 on sale though. Frederick's Meyer uh, premium brand coffee here is on sale for $4.99, no extra purchase required. They have the True Goodness Organic Blends which is the organic coffee by Meyer, 
Been getting some good comments on these lately. $5.99 on sale down from $7.49. And the Costa Coffee here back on sale. $6.99 down from $8.99. Well, they have the Fredericks by Meyer ground coffee bags here. Unfortunately, they don't have my favorite, the Michigan Cherry. They have the Michigan Cherry here, but this is the decaf. They're all out of the regular. $5.49. I guess it's a good time to try one, you know. It's what the regular price was on this, though, a little over a year ago. So, I don't know. Still a sale compared to $7.49. They do have the smaller bags, 12-ounce bags of Starbucks on sale. $6.99 down from $9.69. Then they have some of the bigger bags here, whole bean and ground. $11.99 down from $14.49 does look like they have the ground Duncan on sale as well in the coffee bags here. $6.99. They also got the Imperks deal on the Green Mountain and the McCafe here. Still on that um, Imperks deal. Two for ten or just two for twelve on sale. And they got the Costa Coffee as well of the ground on sale. Good to see that they got the ground coffees on sale as well as the pods. We've been seeing a lot where it has. it's been one or the other usually. Oh, and look at this. They got the Tim Hortons bagged coffee here. Well, this is cool. This is uh, one and a half pounds for $12.99 on sale. Regular price $13.99, but good to see they're getting in the bagged ground coffee. Eh, what a difference a week makes, huh? Pretty much all the pie fillings that we went over last week are on sale this week. So it might be a good idea if you have Meyer and you plan on making some pies for the holidays. I want to buy up a couple of these. There are some okay deals. Not a huge savings on these, but we never see really big savings on these kind of things. But any any little bit of savings is good. Well, no longer on sale, but I will say Meyer seems to have a good amount of flour. It's probably more flour than we've seen pretty much anywhere. Now, they only carry, you know, a couple different varieties. They got Pillsbury, Gold Medal, and all-purpose King Arthur. Actually, all the different King Arthur flowers here. They got some of the smaller ones up here, the organic. Actually... Some pretty good deals up here. $5.79 for this regular price on sale for $3.99. I believe this is the all purpose. Yeah, it's in the wrong spot. This should be here. $1.99 for that. So, yeah, some of the smaller ones here the organic bread flour, $3.99. Pretty close to the same prices on Walmart as far as sugar goes and stuff. And look at this. They got a bunch of the different powdered sugar in confectioner sugar. Got some of the light brown sugar here. Prices went up on them. They're $2.29 now. They're $2.49 at Kroger, though. So uh, $7.29 for the 10-pound bag of sugar. $7.28 for the same thing of the great value at Walmart. $3.29 for the 4 pounds. And then we have these here. Uh, what's this on sale here? Oh, I see one sale. Domino Golden Sugar. 3.5 pounds for $3.99 down from $4.69. So, yeah. Okay, that's one deal. Not much of a savings, but if you're going to be doing some cookie baking, baking some cookies, they do have some of these different morsels and stuff, different chocolate chips, two for six dollars. I feel like we can find these cheaper, but it is Nestle. Um, some of it's going to be here's one for five fifty nine down to five twenty nine. I feel like these are pretty close to the same price as they were last year. Some of these were two ninety nine. I think they went up to three nineteen. But the difference is, is the sale price, two for six. I know these were two for five about this time last year. They may still go down to that, though. We are in the last week of October, so. But, you know, we're a lot of people talking, saying we should buy up a lot of holiday items early for a couple reasons. One, so we avoid more price increases. And two, you know, I mean, in case there's shortages on these things, we know we have some. Kind of a weird sales sticker, but I'll take it dollar a can guys del monte looks like a lot more than just the corn green beans and peas too dollar a can some of the ones oh they got the potatoes here on sale for a dollar nice some of the whole new potatoes yeah these are all a dollar boy get to meyer that's a good deal and they got the gallon jugs of distilled white vinegar by meyer they are 365 but we saw where they just went up to 379 at kroger plus meyer has them all different sizes Wanted to check the canned mushrooms. We've been getting comments that there's been some shortages around the country. Uh, yeah, these are kind of fronted. Nothing behind here by Pennsylvania Dutchman or the Meyer brand. Let's see if there's plenty. Okay, we got plenty right here, though. Pieces and stems mushrooms. Uh, and they've got the organic Pennsylvania Dutchman. Both of those $1.59. 
We do have some more down here. So yeah, if you have Meyer, you may want to check Meyer. I know some people are talking about Aldi having some shortages of mushrooms. We know that Kroger has had its issues um, and some other places. Some people were saying great value also. So next time we go to Walmart, I'll check on that. But yeah, it looks like they got a good amount here at Meyer, except for the sliced. And if you are looking for a variety of different oils, look no further than Meyer. Meyer carries so many different olive oils and cooking oils. It is just crazy. I mean, they have so much. We get a lot of comments on oils lately and a lot of different shortages. We knew this was going to happen. So I want to make sure I pointed this out here today to show you how many cooking oils Meyer has. I don't know how they get all these, but they do. They've got all kinds of different like fancy brands and stuff. I'm not going to go over all the prices. Just wanted to give you a good overview here of all of these. Been getting more and more comments on canned tomatoes going up in price. Some people are saying they've been very low. Someone said that the great value uh, canned tomatoes was in very short supply. We saw that at our Walmart as well. The prices did recently go up and they went up here too. So they are starting to come back in. They got more than they've had in a while here at Meyer, actually, but that's what happens. You see the prices go up, then they start coming back in. Well, since we were on a Velveeta kick last week, I figured I might as well point out a decent sale here. Uh, they got the Imperk Steel. If you use the Imperk Steel, you'll save an extra 50 cents on the big, uh, let's see. Yeah, 32 ounces, two pounds of Velveeta sharp cheddar cheese for $6.49 if you use their digital coupon. However, if you don't use their digital coupon, it's still on sale for $6.99. Now this is what I'm talking about. They got my paste salsa on sale, $1.99 a jar. This is a smaller jar, but these have gone up to $2.69 now. I like it in the glass jar too. I don't like it in the plastic jar. I don't know what it is. I just think the glass jar tastes better. Let me know down in the comments if you think the same. Now one thing's for sure, we continue to see stores get hit by ramen noodles. The more and more these prices go up guys, the more and more these things are gonna start flying off the shelves. I remember when things were going up initially, like a couple years ago, that we couldn't find any ramen because people were, you know, buying this stuff up as the prices were just going through the roof. Now, you know, we're seeing more price increases on things. This stuff is just flying off shelves. Glad to see they got the six packs of ramen back in. But yeah, a lot of the different 12 packs, they only have four of them here. $3.69 for those still same price, but this will be next going up in price. Well, you guys know I always love a good deal on the Nor rice and pasta sides, both included in this digital coupon. You can save a dollar. They are on sale four for five, meaning you will get them for a dollar twenty-five. However, if you use the digital coupon on the Imperks, four for four. I think you can only do that once. So you can buy four of them, you get them each for a dollar. Then you will have to do just the sale price at four for five. A little bit of a sale on rice aroni as well. Dollar twenty-five a box. $1.35 regular price now, $1.50 a box regular price at Kroger. Well, they do have these little minute rice two packs here, three for $5. It's not a, not too bad of a deal right there. I know a few people on the channel that like these, and they have the jasmine rice one here at Meyer. Also, I want to point out they got the Mahatma packets back in. I know some people on the channel that like these. They got the jasmine rice one here, $2.15 for that. Getting more comments on pasta again. Um, they are completely out of their spaghetti here at Meyer. They have a couple things of thin spaghetti. Uh, and that's the two pack or double. So you're getting $1.89 for 32 ounces. Um, yeah, I don't know, they're really spreading this out to make it look like they got more than they actually have. They're even laying these sideways. They do have a sale on Barilla though, $1.49 a box. I know a lot of you on the channel that, like, that swear by Barilla, $1.85 uh, regular price here, uh, $1.99 regular price at Kroger. Guys, it's going to be the next stuff to go up in price. So as you're coming along, finding some sales on spaghetti, I would be buying up a few of these, to be honest. I mean, that's, that's kind of what we're doing um, because seeing all the shortages and all the shortages around the country and around the world, seeing some of these prices, especially when we start seeing great sales on stuff like this, I have a feeling that this is going to be going up. Barilla will be going up. We'll see, we've already been seeing store brands go up. Uh, other things like Cremet and some other ones are going to start going up as well. Not sure when, uh, but, you know, we're not going to wait around to find out. Yeah, some people were talking about chicken broth flying off the shelves too. So they got Swanson. The one that I've been noticing is different store brands. They do have Meyer broth though. 
Um, they did just have this on sale last week. They still got it on sale, dollar twenty-five. Problem with Meyer is that you got to buy four of them. You can't just buy one for a dollar twenty-five. You got to get four. Um, let's see. And you know, we use bouillon, bouillon cubes. So it's ultimately way cheaper to do it like that. Honestly, I think it's a little more flavorful too. I mean, Swanson is good. Don't get me wrong. But you know, we can. I like the uh, Aldi one too, and those are still. Four cups, the same size box. The one at Aldi, the chef's covered one, for $1.29. And since we're talking about bouillon, I thought we would check out the ones they got here. Not too bad a price, really. We stocked up on some of the Kroger brand. We like the Kroger ones. But yeah, they're they're like really expensive now, the Kroger ones. So Weiler's another good brand. Um, some of these better than bouillon things keep going up in price too. But I know we get comments on these on the channel. Here, look at this. Got the Beer Creek here. Beer Creek, Bear Creek, different, uh, same price as uh, Big Lots, so not really saving anything at Big Lots. Looks like they have a little bit more variety here at Meyer as well, except for they don't have the gumbo. Glad I bought up one of those. They do have Campbell's Chunky Soups on sale this week, three for five dollars. Not too bad, making them a dollar sixty-seven a piece. Yeah, same as Kroger on the Amy Soups. They have them down to $3.49 a can this week. Also want to point out, they still have this uh, deal going on on different soup products here at Meyer, Amy Soups included, I believe. Yeah, yeah. all you got to do is look for the little sign in front of it here. It says, buy six or more of select soup products. Get $1.50 off your next shopping purchase. Spend $10, get $3 off. So, got to factor that in as well. Yeah, they got the regular size cans of Hormel Chili on sale, three for six. Got to buy three of them, but that brings it back down to two dollars a piece, what the price used to be. Two dollars a can, yeah, not bad. Well, that is all the time I have at Meyer today. We found some good sales on things. Uh, let's stock up, take advantage of some of these deals as they're here. We are only expecting prices to go up even higher than what they are now. So when we find a sale. We have to buy some of these things up as we see them. Guys, thank you so much for watching the video today. With all that being said, I am out, and always remember the adventure is out.